So today we are going to see the topic on pop up. Okay, how to configure a pop up window. Okay. So here, yesterday we have been uh, in the last class we have done this indirect tags. Okay. So for this select selecting motor and starting. Okay. So I want to like uh, configure it like when I press the motor, I want a pop up window asking start and stop. Okay. I want to open the pop up window using a start stop button. Okay, so I just save this and uh, I go to the in CC Explorer, open this pop up window. Here I configure this object properties, geometry, picture width. I just change this to small size like uh, 300. Also, I will configure. Okay. So, from this motor, what I do, I select start and stop button. Let's save this, then go to pop up. Control C. Okay, then save this window. Okay, save this window. Now, here, I select the motor, events, mouse action, and you press left. Okay, when you press left, right click, go to direct connection, right click for release left. Means when I press and release the left mouse click, I want to show the pop up window. Okay, I select this direct connection in this property. Okay, so by using this property, uh, this object or this object, this property display. Okay. <coughs> So this property we have to display display what anything is there nothing right so we have to configure one picture window okay that means by using this picture window you can create pop-ups okay here standard window this picture window i select this here For this also you can select the size, geometry size of this window, and the properties, 300. Okay. Then which picture we have to display here? Pop up. Okay. So display? No, it should not display. When you go to runtime, okay. So when you click this, select the motor, then only this pop up window should appear. So for that, you can go to that uh, adapt picture, activities adapt picture, and uh, picture name. Which picture name you should open? Pop up. So, okay. okay. Then save this window. Now, now I select the motor, go to the events, then you release. Okay, when you release the left click, it should display this object. Okay, so source property object for this object display. What we should display there is our object in picture. Okay, in this picture window, okay, this object. So that is picture window one. What we need to do is display. Okay, we need to display the picture window. Okay, that's it. Say okay. Similarly, for the motor two, same way, same thing, right click, 
data collection property this object display picture window one and target display the third one also I click direct collection this object display picture window one let's save this one and let's check this in the runtime So when I select this motor, you can see pop up window is open. Okay. So start. Okay. So for this pop up window, we are not given any close option. Right. So you cannot hide it. Okay. For not. So I need to close this. So for this picture window, you also need to select closable. Okay, that is in miscellaneous. Closable that we have to activate. Okay, so we get a border for this window and we get a close option. Okay. Okay. So it's let's see. So when I select this motor, you can see so that I can select. If you want to stop, select this, stop, close. Stop. So this way you can configure pop-up windows. Okay. So 